All right, you guys both ready? Yep. Mm -hmm. Perfect. All right, welcome everyone to another episode of What Would You Do? A live show where we take a deep dive into a variety of questions and give you our thoughts. Joining me today are my friends DJ Kosher and Manderson. How are you guys doing? I'm good. good. How are you? I'm great. I'm great. I need to think of good catchphrases to drop in when you ask me how I'm doing. I feel like I burned through my best one, which is uh, excited to make great content, but maybe I'll just lean into that really hard. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like fish puns is what you need to do. Oh, like fish as puns many are good. fish puns as possible. We're, we're ready to hook another great episode tonight. <laughs> Oh about gosh. to go swimmingly <laughs> okay i'll start a new document with lists of fish puns to start dropping in or a soundboard a soundboard for them. <laughs> uh, okay well thank you both for being here thank everybody in chat for being here this is great um before we jump into the discussion i want to run through a few things for those unfamiliar with the show in just a moment i'm going to be presenting a question to my guests uh, and open a live poll on the stream that you guys can vote in chat. To vote, you're gonna use the command exclamation point vote space number. There's gonna be a number that corresponds to each answer. Those instructions will be on the poll as well, but let us know if you have any questions. If you enjoy the show, be sure to hit follow and turn on notifications here. It's a great free way to support me and always know when I'm going live. Uh, if you have any questions or wanna join the discussion, hop into chat. All right, so if you guys are both ready, I'm gonna ask you today's question. I'm ready. I'm excited. All right. So would you rather have your thoughts appear above your head or have everything you do live streamed? So let me know your thoughts. I'm going to get this pasted in chat. OK. I think immediately I think like, um, like thoughts above my head is just very alarming. Cause like you yeah. could be in a meeting and just like <laughs> think oh my gosh this girl or like this guy whatever yeah what an idiot but having everything <laughs> live streamed, right yeah adds a different element would i know that i'm being live streamed yeah i, mean, I, I think I, I think when you you're you have to make this decision and as soon as you make it like you know you made that decision and it's gonna happen so like when you ever get your answer and it's gonna be thoughts that pop above your head you have a little cloud bubble like that little bubble popping out or you are all of a sudden there's a twitch channel or something some other form of humanslive.com <laughs> yeah this question is so uncomfortable in the best way i know because i agree i agree with you matt that i when i first saw it i was like oh yeah of course i'm gonna well wait a minute <laughs> yeah. both of these suck yeah the one thing i, I like, like i would choose Go ahead. Yeah, go, go, oh, ahead, go for it. Yeah. Okay. So the one thing I like is that uh, if you pick the thoughts above your head, at least when you're home or in private, you're home or in private. Nobody will see your thoughts. The live stream, you have no sense of privacy anymore. Oh, yeah. That's, that's what I was thinking. Okay. Yeah. But here's the question What is it? What is like when I have a thought? Yeah. Like, what if I look at a flower? I'm like, that's like, I'm looking at a flower, but I'm not like saying in my head, that's a nice flower. Like, how do I know <laughs> when the thought is actually a thought and it's not just me like looking at a flower? Yeah, I don't know. So I, I want us oh. to decide that in this question. How do you think you would see thoughts above somebody's head? Because not every thought is just words or, or, or does so everything get converted to text? I just assume that like, everything that was spoke in my mind was being yeah. blasted above my head but you're saying like thoughts yeah like when you eat something and it tastes bad does the text just appear that tastes bad or is it a symbol or a unhappy face like how are these or abstract like thoughts the, shown the phonetic version of the feeling that you feel when you eat something that tastes bad like but in letters so like l w w w p h l w f f f yeah right right um i mean what do you guys think i don't i don't have i'll say that how i guess i i don't i'm trying to think of other examples of abstract thoughts to apply to that logic 
So something that tastes bad, you could have, like you were saying, DJ, a, a string of letters that make that like sound. But that's kind of the idea of converting it to text. So does that same thing apply for like pain? If you get hit in the face, is it just <laughs> ow? Like what, what appears in the bubble? <laughs> yeah. If you verbally are speaking, but also thinking about something, would it pop above your head? Probably, because you could be lying, yeah. or like not, or you could just be like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, lying might be a little drastic, but you could be like doing Minnesota nice things, like right. you know, sticking with the food example. You're eating something that somebody made for you, and you're like, mm. oh yeah, this is this is good, this is and then great. it's just a guy puking above your head. <laughs> This shit sucks. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that bubble's lying. It's definitely not. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ignore the bubble above my head. Don't yeah. ignore the bubble above my head. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Idiot. The the. I think I. Would. Go ahead. Yeah. I I don't know. I I think does it? Why does it change your decision, DJ? If it's just words or if it's symbols and things that mean those thoughts why why did you say I that mean, would change my mind i think just for like well i don't know maybe it doesn't as much as i was thinking yeah because i think the point's going to get across whether it's words or not I, I i bet there are very rare circumstances where you would have a thought that isn't understood in text or shape right like i feel like you're trying to get a little bit of a yeah. loophole to say like if it's a shape yeah. maybe people don't know okay, what i'm thinking right. but they're probably gonna know <laughs> yeah i guess i'm not saying i don't yeah, pick I, that one I still know. in my I mind think everything but... you do i guess it should be somehow translated to like an english readable sentence i guess yeah, that's how I feel like I that's, would do it to make it fair. Because if that's you very say straight you get around yeah. it, then I don't know. Then it seems like cheating almost. Yeah, I, but yeah. it wouldn't really make a difference. Like you're saying, I don't, so hey, I don't think you could get around it. But either situation, I feel like the modifier to it is either every thought is just straight, understandable text, or every thought could some thoughts could be symbols, but those symbols will be clearly understood. Yeah. Okay. So that's I, I think people are gonna yeah. know either way. Um. So we, Coach has already put a vote in for live stream, and that one's scarier for me. I I still don't think I like live stream better. Oh, I think it's far and away the better choice. Really? Really? I don't think so. I mean, if you can get past like the bath, like someone going to the bathroom is going to be live stream, but like it's essentially like the Truman Show. It is. It's, oh, it is exactly the Truman Show, which is like so one of my favorite movies. <laughs> Yeah, and so I don't. In, in fact, the fact that I know that I'm being live streamed is even better, because I can almost be like calculated about how I go about things instead of oh, just that's like. That's true. Do you think you'd ever forget about it though? Absolutely. You I think? think you'd more easily forget about the the thoughts above your head though than you would like live streaming. To to me. Think like, about would... any ac any activity you've ever done and somebody watched you do it, even when you thought you were alone. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's going to be weird at times. <laughs> it's going to be real I mean, but weird. I, I also, there, that is a good point, though, because you get over it real quick, though, I feel like. Like, it'd be embarrassing. Maybe, I guess, can you watch yourself? I feel like that would help get, get oh, over yeah. it. Twitch.tv slash Manderson Live, you know? There's the okay. channel I'm sure you could go to. If and it'd be case, really... If I could just... <laughs> If I can ground myself in the fact that I know that I'm there and I can see myself and that everyone else can see me, I'd probably get over it really fast. So yeah. maybe I swing more of that. <laughs> I would do that one more. You help you help Google develop their Google Glass tech and you just always have the live stream up on your glasses. Uh, and so anytime you're doing something, you're just like, oh man, I look like an idiot right now. <laughs> is it like a um, third person or is it like being streamed through my eyes? Oh, that's a good oh. question too. I like that. I feel like it's got to be third person because if it was just a live feed of what I'm seeing, that's way less invasive. Yeah, I can just close my eyes, right? Or or 
yeah i can just look away <laughs> but i can like watch other people do stuff you don't get to see me do the dumb thing really <laughs> yeah <laughs> i i don't know if i, I like the idea though kind of, of everything i'm doing being live streamed or recorded for anybody to see i think i can deal with people knowing my real thoughts better i don't think i lie that much anyway <laughs> And if it is, it's a white lie. And who needs those? Just you'll know that I don't like what I'm eating or like what you're wearing. Yeah, Honesty's I'm good. torn. It's going to be like. Yeah, you can't like. I know we keep going back to food, but you can't like lie about like liking someone's food. No, but, you know, I, maybe that's for the best for my diet and taste buds, as well as that person's <laughs> cooking. Right um yeah save so that that's basically what it is i think it's going to be a like the office or other third person perspective footage of you all the time like the truman show we talked about earlier um that's that's the kind of the comparison here so like your intimate times everybody gets to watch it <laughs> i don't think i i like that i don't think any of our relationships maybe would survive that they're, I mean, gonna really they're gonna be live they're gonna be live streamed 80% either, of the though. time. Yeah, the truth one, but I feel like I gotta I'm I'm leaning on the fact that I feel like I'm pretty honest anyway, the truth one could help. People just don't have to look at your thoughts. It's a bubble above your head, right? I guess people don't have to watch the live stream, but you know people are. <laughs> right. Yeah. Dude, I don't know. I just think I, that like my life's not that exciting, you know what I mean? So if someone yeah. wants to really sit and watch my live stream, which is just Monday through Friday working, <laughs> going on a yeah. run. <laughs> like, yeah, they're going to be peak interested hours, especially COVID. It's hard to say it'll be that exciting. But I mean, the Truman Show wasn't like a special guy's life. It was a regular life. And I know it's make, made up, but I do believe that if you were the only person being live streamed all the time, um, you would be you would be pretty famous pretty quick yeah um I mean, we're kind of like a real life example of this right now so ali and i watch um big brother and you have access to their cameras and they're filmed 24 7 while they're in this house oh i guess that's this question right and i don't like that <laughs> it's every like bathroom shower like going to bed everything is just filmed yeah and oh, I that's watch weird. It, so. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that's why I'm more comfortable with it. <sighs> but you watch it. You do you not judge those people? Isn't that what that show's all about? Uh, I find it entertaining. Okay. But at the same time, I just think they're kind of boring. Like, yeah. Do you think you would live your life? How? Which one do you think would cause you to live your life more? different than you currently do because i think i would live my life way different with the live stream than i would with just having my thoughts about my head um i don't think i think it would be a learning curve for the thoughts above your head like you eventually would get to the point where you just like because i just think random stuff you know yeah yeah and i think like somebody could be talking to me and i could be thinking about <laughs> 10 other things but I just think that living your life with a stream is just so much easier. But it's interesting to hear that you don't think that. I, f um, okay. Oh, that's, I don't know. Now you, I, I am kind of, I am kind of on the fence about this now. I do, I guess I get what you're saying that life would be easier. I, I get, I could, if I don't care what people see me do live my life exactly the same way man but there are gonna be a, i just i'm trying to think of the worst case scenario in both of these instances and i think the worst case of like i i need to lie right now otherwise terrible things will happen and i can't in the people can see my thoughts version versus i can't let somebody see what i'm about to do but everybody's gonna see it yeah I, I feel like that's worse. More people will know the thing I don't want them to know, I guess, is my outcome.
an, an audience of potentially 7 billion people beats out immediate vicinity audience and my thoughts. Yeah. yeah. It, it could, it, it'll be embarrassing, I mean, but potentially for just me and less people will see it. <laughs> but then maybe at that point you just start speaking your mind more. Yeah. And I, I, I see that as a pro because I, I don't currently want, I don't think I do anything that terrible or embarrassing in my life, but I still don't want people to watch me do it. That's my thought. Oh, it's a tougher okay, question yeah, now back. that we've talked about it. I'm, I'm back on, I'm back on the, the thoughts one. I think I, I shifted a bit to the live stream, but I'd rather I just, too. it's just, it's scary. The la the thoughts thing is scary. I feel like because of how I like, judge shots are private. all the stupid people in the world yeah and yeah like i, I feel i'm probably very harsh when it's like what is this idiot doing trying to talk to me in the supermarket and like spitting in my face when there's a pandemic going around like i like yeah but at the same time honestly like i should say that to that person <laughs> in the supermarket <laughs> but then the like so that but like I'll, but then like i was like people in like maybe work meetings or something like that or i don't know potential a friend of something you don't agree with or whatever yeah but there are sensitive like the hardest, interactions hardest, yeah the hardest thing would be like re relationships because because you just very lie all the person, time and so my <laughs> my snap thoughts to like things like that well you know that like my girlfriend would say would be like could be might abrasive. Not be the right, might not be the right thought, but are definitely abrasive or something. Yeah, and I have yeah. to like make sure I don't react right away. And I still mess it up and react later, thinking the same thing. You know, it's just my logical brain compared to like something that is not time for, where it's not time for the logic. She's yeah. probably just laughing if she's watching this. But um, I, I don't know, but I, I now. That'd be, I, yeah, or my parents, like offending my parents somehow because they're yeah. my parents. <laughs> Because they're your parents and you don't want to. Yeah. Man, now I, now I don't know, though. I, I am struggling with this question. I, my Again, my, my gut instinct is to go with displaying my thoughts and hope for the best. And, and just try to avoid picking, situations. By not picking your thoughts, it's not that, like, you're a horrible person and, like, you just lie in every <laughs> occasion. But I just think, like, thoughts are so private at times. But like, you don't think your privacy physically is private or more so like i guess i guess I with guess that logic somebody could battery. always be watching right like <laughs> yeah i think it's just flattering if someone actually wants to tune into my life as a live stream yeah so but you could be some people uh, want to see I, I guess I, I feel like I need to go back to my original logic, which I almost forgot about, but I got back to it. If people can just see my thoughts, I could still have a sanctuary that when I'm alone, I'm truly alone. And it doesn't matter yeah. what I think or say or do. There's still privacy built in to only having people see my thoughts. There is a no more privacy in your entire life with the live stream. I think that's my logic to get me to picking thoughts. I feel like I'm, that's where I'm at too. I feel like I can't weigh the value of that, like just thinking about it. But like, I feel like if I got to having to do one or the other or like experiencing both, I would like that better. Yeah. Like but there's I a think... certain anxiety I feel like you have to deal with. Just You just have a little bit more anxiety in your life with either situation yeah. and being oh, able to yeah. escape it with one of them is like probably super important, like for your mental health. <laughs> yeah. You will probably have more confrontation with the thoughts. I, I agree with That's that. That's true. One hundred percent. But you can uh, you could avoid those confrontations. I can, I can just like, live at home all the can, time. <laughs> I mean, what do I do right now? <laughs> so it's like yeah, easy peasy. <laughs> um, That's that's very true. Ooh, yeah. I this is a I tough don't. One. This is the I, hardest question yet. It is. I think it is. I don't want to be Truman. <laughs> I would need to escape the dome like Truman did at some point and you wouldn't be able to. Yeah. I like this question. This well, was okay, good. But how about yeah. this? Do you reap the benefits of being live all the time? Like, are you famous and do you have sponsors and like money and- You, I think you could definitely 
capitalize on this opportunity. You, I think you would become famous and therefore you would have the benefits of being famous and the cons. You'd have the cons of being famous. But yeah. I think hmm. if you became famous enough and people were interested, you would, I mean, think you're on all the time. A company would be like, hey, can you just wear this shirt for a day or two? Like you get paid to brand during a thing or come eat at this restaurant. That's crazy. Yeah, you could definitely monetize that. Yeah, I mean that's what they did in the Truman Show, right? Didn't they have yeah. like they wear oh, product, product placements? He's like, "What are you doing?" <laughs> yeah, she poured yeah. that that glass of milk and she just like pointed at it. Yeah, <laughs> he was like, "What are you doing?" Uh, yeah, I don't think the monetize monetize that's a bad word. I don't think the financial benefit uh, is worth it in my mind still. Well, you also just have to think well, too. Of you know, your your family and friends and significant others um like for the the streaming portion too because oh, yeah gonna they're gonna watch you they're gonna watch you and potentially be on it right like how would you guys feel if i was my life was live streamed and I, you guys were in it i want to i want okay i'm gonna answer that question but i want to know how it affects your answer okay. i would ne i would never be the same around you ever again because I in would know way. I'm live. I, I know I'm live and I need to present myself in a way that's acceptable to 7 billion people, potentially. I would I would be in the most public version of myself ever and I wouldn't ever feel comfortable opening up to you about something again because it's not private. Anything I tell oh. you, everybody else gets to know. That is true, though. <laughs> unless you whisper in. Yeah, unless I get really quiet. But those mics get pretty sensitive. I'm just guessing there's gonna be some nice tech on this on this live yeah. set. <laughs> yeah, that plays a factor, I guess. I didn't think about that. Like no one would probably confide in you anymore. No. Hmm. And and potentially some people wouldn't even hang out with you anymore because they really don't wanna be on a live show for the world. That might yeah. be a small group of people, but I'm sure there's some people that'd be like, Yeah, I'm I can't see Matt anymore. <laughs> yeah. Couldn't lie um, about how well they do at golf anymore. No, everybody would know. Yeah. But okay, if you got to reap the benefits though, I mean what you're trying to do right now, Fish, be a streamer, you just get to be one. Like, <laughs> you, you just are it. one. Yeah. And you don't even have to worry about audio because someone else is apparently <laughs> it's, it's doing somebody that. Somebody else's for you. equipment. <laughs> That's a good so point. So you just get to play video games <laughs> and have sponsors and just do whatever you want all the time. That's true. But I will say I think the stress of that lifestyle being live stream all the time is different than me being able to click start and stop and walk away. That's true. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Uh, I want to bring it into a to your side. I don't what was know. That? I'm just thinking I'd go to your side again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Well, if you get the, to read the, the money, benefits, the money is drawn DJ over. Well, it's not just the money, though, but like your whole life changes. Like you can do whatever you want. You don't have like a job to worry about. Like, yeah. But then also, like, if you get enough to, like, afford, not even, like, if you had a zillion dollars because of it, but, like, if you had enough to have your income, but do exactly what you wanted at any given moment, not just, like, I want to do this whole thing for a career, but, like, yeah. today I want to do this, and tomorrow <laughs> I want to do this, and they're different. Like, you could just yeah. do that. Yeah, that's true. But maybe I that's think... not, maybe that would actually hurt me, too, because, like, maybe I wouldn't be enough, like, there wouldn't be enough structure, and I wouldn't like that. Oh my the god! Thing Cody said it's so hard. The one that hit me. That, that's like, the one. The social interactions with the people you love. <laughs> maybe they don't want to see me, or they won't be their true selves. Yeah. Like even a phone call, like I'm sure, or a text, like those would be. Yeah. Different. Even if they're, I guess, in those instances, because I think you would still have autonomy over, like, just don't put it on speakerphone and at least their side of the audio won't get picked up. So that would be a way to get around it or try to hide your phone when you text with somebody. Those would be like your only ways to get true interactions or private moments with people. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I, want, I want to catch up a, little, a couple of thoughts in right. chat because I think Koji has a good point that uh, you're, it's, both cases could just bring out the worst in yourself that if your thoughts are up there, you're just going to lean into it and just stop caring. Like, who cares if you know what I think? And I think that's... I think I see that as a good thing, not necessarily a, a bad thing or bringing out the worst in me. Um, and then if you know everybody's mm -hmm. watching, you may just start doing things because you know people will watch. I think that's true too, but not necessarily a bad thing. 
especially in the case of like making money. You could get paid to go to an amusement park because they want to show off all the rides. <laughs> like that's awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What if you go see a movie? And like someone oh. could just you could be you could pay for the movie theater and then someone could just <laughs> watch it. Yeah. From your stream. I, I, I wonder if the audio would get picked up, but they would just do a they would do a front view so that it doesn't capture the vid, the movie screen. It just captures your face and your reactions. <laughs> it's not like yeah, over wait, the shoulder. Who has, popcorn in who has control of like the production of of your of the stream of your life? I think there's gonna be like, a very Truman are they Truman taking show good shots during like sexy time? Like you know, like are they getting the good angles or <laughs> what's the deal here? Because those are good questions. <laughs> I think it's up to the director. Um, because I picture a very Truman Show esque like studio with all the shots and cameras and things that can happen, and then they pick what's on air. And so, if you have a, a tasteful director, they would like get something in the way of the camera that makes it clear that you know what you're doing, but it's not like showing everything. Or you get a uh, what I'll call a bad director, mm -hmm. and they're just like, yeah, top down camera, side camera, every angle you want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I don't know the answer to that. I, I I see a mystical drone camera that's always following you, in which case then it would probably always have a, a view of you. They wouldn't like tastefully cover something up. Yeah. Dude, I'm know. I'm in the so thoughts. I think I'm solidly in the thoughts boat. I think <laughs> I'm closer to the thoughts than I was when I first started. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Here, I'm going to I'm going to be a sole voice at this point. I'm going to throw this uh this vote in there. There we go. Oh, one got thoughts. We're, we're 2 to 1. The, the other the, some of the people in chat have already they locked in live stream pretty early. Um but yeah, coaches, you can be in charge of production. It's all unflattering camera shots. That I would expect nothing less, but I picked thoughts, so I'm I'm in the clear. <laughs> Do you yeah. guys feel like you can lock in an answer or, or are you so are you really on the fence with this one? I'm so on the fence. I, I don't know. One. I need to make a decision though. I will just give me a second. I mean, yeah, I'm we can we can talk it through it. We can talk through it more if you want. And I'm, I'm trying to think of other situations. I just can't decide. This is like straight up. I don't know what to decide. Like I understand. Like, I feel like um, I, I got to go <laughs> for I feel like I got to go for the live stream now, like Really? Are you, so is was, is the motivating factor for that the money, like the riches, the being able to do whatever you want? I just is that think the driving there's force? There's even for that? more possibility. It's not just money, but I just feel like it's like the possibilities for like life could be tremendous. Like you get to do so many things, or maybe, and yeah. I feel like that's worth yeah. it. And then I also can keep my thoughts to myself. Yeah. I think I'm locking it in. I'm gonna do it. Bad. Oh, the thing that's bringing me back to the thoughts one is, Cody, you've alluded to it, but like, we've we've like grown up in a society where like, you shouldn't tell people what you think, and so maybe yeah. that's why this one is so hard. But maybe in reality, we should tell people what we think. Um, Transparency, be more open. This maybe yeah. not in such an abrasive way, but yeah. Uh, like that's what I was initially thinking. Like I just don't want to hurt, I don't want to hurt people's feelings and stuff. And then I was like, well, I guess maybe I don't care about that. But like, then I thought like, I don't know, maybe like there's risk there where it's like you could really do something to someone just by uh, saying, thinking something. Like I don't know. Like I don't think I have bad that bad of thoughts, but maybe I do. Like I don't, I don't really know. Like I just. <laughs> How, okay, I'm I'm gonna take this a step further on our. On our example of tasting somebody's cooking and it's bad, and, and obviously they see your thought that you don't like it. Usually at the same time you're making the decision to say like, oh yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty good, or oh it's it's good. Aren't you also thinking, oh, I need to tell them it's good so I don't hurt their feelings? So is that thought going to be conveyed? Like, yes, there might be the initial thought of, oh, I don't like that, but it'll be right followed up, like kicked out of that bubble because right after it is. Oh, I don't want to hurt this person's feeling. Like, 
is that a benefit, right? They're going to see that thought process too and be like, oh, they, they do care. Like, yeah, they, they didn't actually like it. I, they saw their actual thought, but like, I, I get why they don't want to hurt my feelings or something. I feel like usually our thoughts have good intentions that would also be conveyed in the thought bubble. That leads me to a question then. Yeah. How long are these thoughts staying up there? Because are they immediately erased the next thought that comes in? Yeah, I think so. Think of it like a chat stream, right? I think it's just kicking it out. If it's immediately, though, like you only see one? Is that what you're saying, Matt? Yeah, that's my question. Because you could... How do we know that they're <laughs> reading it as quickly as you're thinking it? That's my. I'm trying you're to find you're, a you're trying to talk to Eminem, and his bubble's just flashing yeah. words so fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. I. Or is it like I, I can go back and scroll up? I I think I don't. You can't scroll up for sure. So whether it's just one line at a time or one symbol at a time, or maybe you can see like the one previous thought, it, it gets replaced though. You can't like go back. Somebody couldn't go back through it. It's like, I can see your thoughts right now. That's but, it. I can see your thoughts right now. But like for your example, if, if my thought of like, this is this pie tastes like butthole. And then the next thought of, I should tell them it tastes nice. Cause it's good. They won't actually see the one before that, that, that's valuable, I feel like, but that's like a you're, loophole. You're, kind of they're looking at you, and then like you're waiting for them to turn around, and as soon as they turn, you're like, you start taking a bite. <laughs> I mean, I, 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 th I think it, I think it's a feed. It's not up all the time. You could play the system to try to hide the thoughts you don't want people to see. Can you put a hat on that hide it? Nope. I think it's a magical <laughs> bubble that's visible above your head. Somebody had mentioned in chat, like, can you cut it off? Could I could I move my camera cut off here that my bubble would be out of view? I think if you were streaming yourself, you could. Or if you're getting a picture taken or something. But people will be able to see it around you. It's floating above your head. You can't cover it up. Your thought bubble's just like in pictures for years to come. Just yeah. like smile. You're just like, oh god, this sucks. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm standing next to Dave. Ugh. <laughs> oh, wait. Coachrace has a good point in the chat. Can I use thoughts to be a famous person? Like, create a show just of myself? Yeah. I, I think my utilize will, it. If you can think which of a I can turn way. off. And then yeah. have, like, a reality show where everyone can see my thoughts. I think that Definitely. might be viewed. I think you can do that. I'm, I mean, I locked oh, in my geez, answer why? on thoughts, I but I, Soville says, and I think this is what you're getting at, Matt, uh, maybe having your thoughts uh, visible would lead to everyone being better people. Like, maybe we should be more honest. I'm leaning on that, too, in my picture, in my decision of thoughts, that I think it can help benefit relationships as well. It can harm some or harm parts of some, but I think it's a benefit. This could also lead to your friends and family coming to you more often because they want the truth yeah that's true when your mom's your when you have somebody working on a new dish and they actually do want to know if it's good or bad like not a feelings issue and just like hey did i actually do a good job cooking this <laughs> <laughs> yeah I, I think that's a good point you could get they would at least be selectively coming to you there's maybe some things they're not going to come to you for anymore but there's more they could be talking to you about so i think all three of us are locked in i'm thoughts uh manderson you just did thoughts okay mm -hmm. dj and you were live stream i switched to live stream for my final my final vote i just feel like i there's, like i like there's possibilities i feel I, like there's possibilities i can't even understand and <laughs> more more there than with i don't know i'm taking kind of a chance yeah you want the time to figure it out though yeah i feel like i have to be in it to really know if it was worth it yeah i get that <laughs> I really like Which, that. Honestly, I don't want either. I don't really want either. So, like, <laughs> like, I'll just be normal, but like if I had to. <laughs> yeah. I like that this was one of our toughest questions. And I really like that both of you started on the other side and ended up at a different yeah. one. Yeah, I, I really like that. <laughs> Can I say, Matt? Um, you just keep it? digging further and you keep like asking more questions. And you're like, I don't know if I really want that. Yeah. <laughs> It's all the pros and cons. Yeah, you got to weigh all the options. So thoughts aren't that bad. Yeah, I, I I think that's that's it. Thoughts aren't that bad. We can we would be we would make it through. You and I could hang out all the time, Matt. We're gonna always know what the other person's thinking. <laughs> that DJ guy's just live streamed. We don't want to hang out with him anymore. <laughs> Guys, coming out with me. 
Hey, go man, to how's Cabo. your live stream going? Evening. That guy's an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That would be perfect. <laughs> All right. Uh, that was fantastic. I'm excited for this one. Uh, so we're going to wrap this up. Uh, nobody needs to go anywhere. The live stream's continuing. If we think of any other modifications to this, we can talk about them, bring them up in chat. I can even leave the poll up for a little while if we want or bring it back out later. Um, so the discussion, discussion can continue. I want to thank my guests again for being here. Thank everybody in chat for jumping into the conversation, letting us know what you think. Uh, remember to click the follow button if you haven't, or stop by twitch.tv uh, slash fishmobile to give a follow and click on that notification button. It's a free way to support uh, the stream and help me grow. Uh, if you're catching this on YouTube, you can also hit the subscribe and notifications there um, to know when videos go live. These get posted the day after we record them. Uh, if you want to be a part of the discussion, again, join me here on Twitch on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Thank you, everyone. Thanks, guys. Peace. Thank you. Bye.